Today we are reading um, from page 63. So we are reading, uh, continuing reading Temple of Love. Uh, page 63, title Fate. Everything fine? Yeah, uh, one devotee asked me which kind of Zoom ID I will send. Oh, okay, okay. Sorry. Okay. So, yeah, please, everyone who feel, has some feeling, <clears throat> would like to share something, uh, please. <laughs> It is a class on 26th February 2014. So Guru Dev saying, I give an example. See, all my sons and daughters I consider them all to be my family. Whether they have been sent to me by my Gurudev or been born to me. They all have different stages of faith. But I am creating the changes that by practice and association they will grow in faith. Because those who live with me more and more, that way I'm watching to them. Mm. And they learn organizing everything for the service of Radha Mohan. Service is the way to love. And I know that others don't know. But by looking, observing, their interest will grow. May I ask one question? Radhe. So, Dandavatu, please help us. Yeah, it's okay. Yeah, Radhe. Thank you. So, here Guru Dev says, service is. So, service is a way to love. Gurudev says, service is the way to love. Then I would like to ask, make me clear that what is the difference service and business? What does it mean service? What does it mean be business? Then we can understand service is the way to love grow. Please help this question. <laughs> Anyone has a solution? <laughs> Proposal? <laughs> mm. 
Kishori did just to start. Anyway, so we need to start. Business <laughs> means support. This means what I expect some result for myself. It's business connected to the uh, fault ego. Mm. Yes, this is connected with uh, bodily consciousness. And service did, uh, first of all, by Swarupa and under the influence of Swarupa in Sarakadeha. Uh, and someone who is dear to Ishtadeota, means Ishtadeota in heart of devotees. Mm -hmm. I, I spoke something rather <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> mm. Mm. Uh, Attached to them say very nicely that business work is a money exchange work word. Like uh, if you see what is your business, then people say I do this business to earn money. But uh, also, what I do is also business. Like uh, Pujari is doing the business to serve the Radha Mohan. And kitchen man is doing business to serve in kitchen. And gate man business is also to take care of the gate. Gardener business to take care of the garden. So, business has a two mood. I want a business to, in the service mood, my responsibility because this is not mine. I am serving for that. And that way I serve for my Swamini's king. Uh, business as a manager, that is also business. Like uh, this company is the Swamini company, and I am the manager there. And who is the boss? Radharani is the boss. And I do the responsible work like a manager. And also, I do this service because she gave me this respon responsibility to serve it. So, uh, as, a, as a, my responsibility to serve it, right? Yes. So, what business? For my benefit, business, or for your benefit? <laughs> Mm -hmm. Business I am doing. So this is the difference. Mm -hmm. For my benefit, if I do is is a, is also good, but the benefit goes to me or my family that is to see. Mm -hmm. The best thing if you make boss to her and do business, no problem. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and devotion means devotion and vegan there are two things devotion means I do what you like because I love you and I want to make you happy so I want to serve you for your happiness this is devotion. Mm. And vegan is say, what I like, I will do that. Mm. You accept or not accept, but I will do that what I like. Because I don't take the milk and you have to stop to take the milk. If you want to associate with me, you have to stop 
then I will accept you. <laughs> condition. Mm. And the way means there is no condition. I want to make you happy. And what is your desire, I will do for that. That is good. What you like, you decide and like this. Right? Yes. Yes, good Adev. <laughs> Thank you. Is also not bad. If she is the boss, my sister Dave is the boss. She is the goal for everything. <laughs> it's really beautiful, Guru Dev. <laughs> Thank you so much. Mm. So Guru Dev continues. The same way it happened in my life. I had no faith, no interest. And when I look how others doing, <laughs> I start doing it. And I develop interest and faith to grow. All family members have to know this. It is my practical experience in life. So, I'm not sannyasi, so renounced, that my family members cannot come. They all have to come together and learn this seva mood. <laughs> rad, rad. This year, this year is uh, 14. I was a I am not sunnyans. <laughs> and this is a fact. Further out. I travel the whole world for the other. I do anything for others. So, and for my guru. His order, Prabhupada's order, is fulfilled. I do this is not so. I know the difference between my guru Dev and Prabhupada. Because my guru Dev sent to Prabhupada. Shirad. If you have a firm faith in your Ishtadev and Vrajadam, everything will be fine in your life. Shripad prays, <clears throat> O Radha and Madhava, 
guru dev kat sin. You see? Very clear. Radha and Madhava. We practice Madhava and Radha prayers. So I don't want to stay in Vrindavan. But when you will start Radha's Madhava Seva, you will not be able to leave Vrindavan. Wow. This is a very deep meaning. Then Gurudev continues. The point is this. If you desire to directly approach God, you will never easily get darshan of God. But if your desire is to be close with God, then we have to be close to a beloved of God. A lover desires only one thing. what my beloved desires. Mm. So you see, like in life of Jesus, Jesus only loves his father. Jesus said, if you are happy, that I go from here. I'm happy also. I'm happy to go. But I want to be always in love with you. Mm. This is devotion. <laughs> and why Jesus sends all of you here? Because he sees your soul. And he says, this is not your place. You have to go to Vrindavan. Mm. <laughs> mm. Mm. Shirad. Take the shelter of Radhika. She is the goddess of love. She will give you devotion in life. It's not a religion. It is pure devotion with spirituality where, where all divine has to be respected and always you have to feel it. Once again, it's not a religion. It is pure devotion with spirituality where all divine has to be respected and always you have to feel it. Shirat.
now follows follows uh, commentary on reading on Jaiva Dharma. Mm. Jai Radhas Madhava. He is Radhika's Madhava. I took shelter of Radhika. Then I can reach to the Kunj. She, Radhika, will show me the way hmm. to her Kunja Bihari. Hmm. A foolish child can understand Vrajendra Nandana. What is the meaning? First, you have to become like a child. And you have to become like a fool <laughs> <laughs> to understand Vrajendra Nandana. Philosophy will not bring you there. Swamini, I want to be. Uh, I want to be with you because of your love. I have no other interest now. This is. Palia Dasi Seva. Palia Dasi never runs for Krishna. Mm. Krishna is running for Palia Dasi. And Palia Dasi says, No, no, no. I have no time for you. You are a womanizer. I want my Swamini only. Krishna says, What do you like? You are alone. I can kiss you. No, no. I want to be with my Swamini only. This is a very deep subject. And uh, I don't want to be in that assembly where no one speaks of Swamini. I don't want to be happy with that. It's enough now. Gurudev continues. Firm faith is important. Mm -hmm. Because we want to work out everything with the mind. We don't want to go to feelings. Mind and feelings are separate things. Mm -hmm. There are no feelings when we use our mind. Mm -hmm. And when you are working with feelings, no mind. <laughs> Your heart is working. Could you explain about this point? Mind has no feelings. Mm. 
Uh, from my life, my experience is mind is works more like calculator. Mm. It's always uh, calculating. I would like to invest uh, the less possible and get the most possible. Yeah. It's very selfish. And this calculation is, yeah, doesn't let love of soul out. Always fear. <laughs> <laughs> I remember once <laughs> one devotee asked a guru, asked the guru, not you, Guru, then. <laughs> One Guru. Ask him, what this, how can I go, get Krishna with the least effort? <laughs> I want to invest the smallest I can and get the, bi the biggest result. <laughs> then? Then the Guru answered, yeah, you offer yourself and then Krishna gives you himself. <laughs> <laughs> Just that. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> self for self. This is the mathematics. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Oh my God! <laughs> we were all amazed how this question even comes. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it's possible to ask this kind of question. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> Very polite. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so this is about mind. <laughs> yeah, actually what I feel, it's difficult to understand the difference of feeling and the mind. Uh, like, for me, very new. So, mm. sometimes, oh, maybe I understand, but it's very difficult to understand this, what is mind and what is feelings. Yeah. Sometimes, I say this is a feeling, but totally calculation. <laughs> I'm using a feeling, but I feel from my heart, not here. <laughs> but using here, then this say I'm using from my heart like this, right? Yeah. <laughs> it's very yucky. So that's why good they always say, check ourselves inside. If we try to go to check others, I say from my heart to you, it's good for you. But actually, this mind, some calculation, sometimes it's very difficult. That's why I need to check myself. Yeah. Maybe remember my uh, private story. First, I come, yeah. I, I came Brindava. I met you first time, maybe seven years ago, eight years ago, so. At that time, I'm totally new, still new, but I'm at that time totally, totally new. And I asked to you one question. What is important in bhakti? At that time, many answers will come, but at that time, for me, your answer is that. Just to be honest. <laughs> this I always remember. Be honest, be honest. I have to be honest to see myself. I don't want to cheat about myself. It's very difficult sometimes I need to see some dirty things inside also. 
But this be honest. Otherwise, no one can change me. I have to change by myself. This be honest is very deep meaning, and I remember this story. I'm very, very, very thanks to you. I'm glad、mm-hmm. to share with you. Thank you. Thank you so much, Guru Dev. Yeah. I, I would like to add one thing that this, how to say, this calculating selfish mind.、Mm. We are so used to it. We think it's me thinking.、Mm. We are so used to this calculation, and it takes really this higher power to, to break through. See someone selflessly loving in action. And doing it、mm. with full power, full enthusiasm. And then when we see it, we are amazed. Oh, it's possible.、Mm-hmm. It's possible that I love someone so much that I want to give my life to this person. And.、Uh, Seems to me that this is only possible soul to soul, soul to Ishtadev. Yeah, I'm not a man. Radhe. 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 Soul to soul and soul to Ishtadev. <laughs> Because <laughs> <laughs> any connection come in between is all. <laughs> We need direct connection. Yeah, nothing in between.、Mm-hmm. Yeah, this this. Hmm. It takes courage. It takes courage for this change. We need from someone this energy to push us there, to、uh, like pull us there and push us there to dare. My dear, our original position is a spirit soul. Yes. Original.、Mm. And we are in the air. Floating without body, <laughs> that is my original push.、Mm. Then we pray that one body I got, then I will serve to Lord.、Mm. Mm. And Lord say, one mother is giving birth. You want to go there? This is his condition. His、mm. mother, the pig. You want to take body there in the own the pig? Yes, yes. I want to take body because I'm hundred years suffer in the nowhere.、Mm. But the position is a spirit,、mm. and I take the pig body. Then some、uh, good luck, fortunate soul, take the the human body.、Mm. But reality is, we are a spirit soul, some something without body there, like a ghost. Hmm. And we pray, and we got the body. And the, when we took the birth in the wound, also we are praying that we will come out. Then we will do that. When we come out, then we start forgetting myself. Hmm. 
then we start identity material body only and all connection with the material relation hmm that's why what? yes what is my original position covering not hmm reality is my position that is my constitutional position we enter in the flesh hmm this is the reality shirad but now we have hope gurudev <laughs> because you are sharing with us and your love is down the <laughs> yeah radha's love <laughs> kishori mai <laughs> radha rad <laughs> suniti ji would you like to add some radha tanda bat radha tanda bat no it's perfect to listen <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, <laughs> Radhe and Dr. Prabhu. Ah, Radhe. Maybe uh you can uh, read again this last sentence uh, what I remember Gurudev said uh here that the mind and the feelings are two different Separate. things. Mm. Separate things. and we know also that uh, uh raga sadhana raga bhakti is called like mental religion so um so it means that even if is useful useless material mind it can be only hope also if we put the lila in the center so it become it's uh he changed his nature he became spiritual because if gurudev said something about that hmm gurudev please <laughs> enlighten us <laughs> actually our material body ego mind is one thing because we are identifying with my false ego with flesh body we my mind is working for material one plus one because I, my existence is now material my ego say you are not a soul are you a material body you have to 2 plus 2 4 and 4 plus 4 8 to do this is your job to come you come to be a richest bella dalmi a big man and you have to eh uh, you have to be richest man and famous and guru big guru and everything you go you go say that too this is material mind working in sense of my material body working na mm. yes <laughs> god help us yeah so <laughs> as say bhagavad gita 10 12 15 12 14 and 12 14 see that bhagavad gita just a moment gurudev we will find mm. uh 12 14 yeah so 13 14 is one 12 13 14 is one 12 13 hmm. uh, would you like me to read translation yeah yeah ah, okay so bhagavad gita chapter 
devotional service. Yeah, yeah devotional service. Bhakti yoga. Yeah. No, devotional service. <laughs> devotional <laughs> service. <laughs> Bhakti yoga means vegan service also. Having a service. We devotional service. <laughs> <laughs> We are doing vegan services. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, I am worried about that. Okay. <laughs> In the name of Bhakti, there is a vegan service. Uh, but <laughs> Prabhupada said devotional service. I got it. Okay. <laughs> so, translation. One. Who is not envious, but who is kind friend of all living entities? Wow. 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 <laughs> <laughs> One who does not think himself an owner proprietor yeah, oh, company business <laughs> 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 all answer will come my dear <laughs> <laughs> oh next is very good who is free from false ego ah you Round see head. <laughs> Who is equal both in happiness in distress? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Rad. Rad. Who is always satisfied? She Rad. She Rad. Engaged in devotional service with determination. That's the point. Mm. No ping pong. Mm. And whose mind and intelligence are in agreement with me. That is my point. That hmm. I say. <laughs> my and intelligent is my feeling. Hmm. Uh, read again this one. Okay. From the beginning. No, no, only this line. Only this mind. one. Ah. One whose mind and intelligence are in agreement with me. Never agreement. <laughs> you know this. Oops. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Mind, <laughs> <laughs> intelligence, but agree one to each other. Check. <laughs> Fighting is going on. <laughs> <laughs> Mind said this. I will go to the gambling house. I will go for this and intelligence and no, no, this is not for you. Don't do this. Always fighting going. Mm. Mm. So I say mind and feelings. Mm. Mm. We need manasiksha or mind. Acharya has always pray for mind. So Guru Dev. Uh, Gurudev, you would trans, you would say then like this, whose mind and feelings are in agreement with me. The, I, yeah, that is my point. Ah. That I say in different direction. Hmm. Mm. Mind is different thing, your feeling is different thing. Mm. Mm. And when this agree, you start looking. Mm. Mind is coming to your soul consciousness, then it will be agree. Mm. Ego, not agree. 
in your material identification, mind will not accept to his guru. He will reject guru also. Hmm. Because he has a desire for sense enjoyment. Hmm. Hmm. Anyone, because he's not angry because of his mind, why he will listen to Guru? Hmm. But mind one, Guru will not agree. <laughs> Any special person will not agree. This is our mental problem. For ego mind, mm. if mind goes to my sarup, that same mind will change. Mm. <clears throat> it will become useful. Mm. This mind is Prabhupada is telling, who is living in the false ego, that mind. Mm. Mm. In that way, we conflict create the mind is created, the conflict with the feelings, intelligence. Mm. Intelligence is feeling. Mm. Intelligence thing is a is a, a living in your Self identification. This mm. is it. Mm. Mm. It's in feeling, and this is this is intelligence. Radha. Mm. And same mind of Binod Baba, a Mahaniji Swami, is different way working. <laughs> because is fixed is saru identification. Mm. That mm. is the most balanced person because intelligence and mind is in agreement. No inner conflict. Yeah, my God. This inner conflict eats, eats the soul. Inner conflict create outer conflict. Yeah. Yep. It's all conflict, what we see outside is inside fighting, mm. it, it reacts out. Mm. Mm. My God. So if we forget to love, we forget to see the Prabhupada. When the Prabhupada were so many projects happen without problem, projects happen. Mm. One thousand projects are running and all is become positive. Mm. Yeah. And after leaving Prabhupada, what happened? This was that reason was intelligence was gone because Prabhupada was the doing for his history Radha mm. for his Radha Krishna. Mm. That the intelligent person is gone, then they start different type of conflict that all start going down. So this is the point. Mm. Who connected with divine, he is he can see different mm. the power energy and he himself take care. Mm. Mm. This is the point. Mm. And we are connected with material then material effects come. Mm. Sri Radha. Sri Prabhupada ki 
Sri Radha. So, and the last few words of Krishna, the one who is like this is very dear to me. You don't need to say, dear, you are my dear Krishna, come here. <laughs> you can't say to you this, that you are dear to me, <laughs> if you do this, why not yeah. we do this? Yeah. Krishna say, Hare, my dear, if you do this, you are my dear, I will jump and come to you. Rad. <laughs> Read again, what is the meaning? Ah. He is very dear to me. Yes, I will go to my dear. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Natural. Natural. Ah. But I'm not ready to do because <laughs> material thing is so good for me. <laughs> yeah. How I will leave it. <laughs> How I will live to enjoy my senses, how I live to earn money, <laughs> how I not believe in my children, they are the hope of my life. Uh. <laughs> they are, they are, <laughs> wait and watch. <laughs> 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 they are very effective destruction. Very <laughs> nice, beautiful. <laughs> Sri Radha. <clears throat> Jai Guru Dev. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. I need to read. I will, Ramani, I will read very, very slowly. Just one part of, uh, of Prabhupada's purport. <laughs> it's very nice purport. <laughs> ah, Rad, Shri Rad. Very good. <laughs> Thank you. Arigato gozaimasu. So, Prabhupada commenting. Coming again to the point of pure devotional service, the Lord is describing the transcendental qualifications of a pure devotee in these two verses. What is transcendental? Ah, you're back. Very good. <laughs> I don't know. I explained that. Volunteers for explanation. <laughs> we need I want to know who is listening us to them. Yes, yes, yes. Volunteers. Uh, Danidi. Yes, some suggestion yes. some suggestions. <laughs> what is transcendental? Yeah. <laughs> Transcendental uh, means is not touched by material world. He is present only in the spiritual world. Mm -hmm. Not in false ego, but in real ego. Mm -hmm. Our transcendental soul is 24-7, is covered with material, material thing. Covered with the, so many layers. Mm. <laughs> Praname, Kosh, Anname, Kosh, nine, seven bodies we have a cover to enter in a, uh, my spirit, spirit, seven, nine layers are covered. Mm. Right or not? Mm. Those 
body yes yes kosa Hmm. And that we have to reach. If I want to know divine, I have to come to that point, my dear. To my divine, to see divine. Hmm. Why not? I can see Krishna in the temple because I see the wooden. Murtis, mm. plastic murti. Why? Because I am covered with so many wood and plastic. What I can see more than that? Mm. I cannot see my original divine, so I cannot see their divine. Hmm. I cannot relate my divine. I cannot relate this divine. I need that vision to see that, right? Mm. Not? Yes. Hmm. That is only to do. So where to do? We have to go to the seven, eight kosa in there. But in one by one, we have to enter there. If you cover with seven, eight, nine kosas, body, and you say, "I see that," how we can see that? Mm. Mm. We have to do the sadhana to enter there in my original position. That is my shravan and kirtan bhajan kriya. But we have to chanting by that to enter there. We want without doing any efforts. I can enter impossible. That is our sadhana. Nothing more outside what sadhana we can do. We do all sadhana to become forty years, eighty years old. What about what we do? What happened? This is my sadhana, mm -hmm. but this sadhana not works. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this sadhana is to go penetrate after breaking the kosas to the reality. Mm. That reality, divine reality. Mm. Mm. And Maya will catch you. You try, and Maya will come here and there and try to bring out. This is the. <laughs> The Maya work, mind work in the sleeping time will work you to confuse you. Sitting time it will work. If you leave the japa, it will confuse you. Mm. Any moment they will think you. I say myself. They want to catch me. It is a soul body. Mm. Be careful, guy. Nobody is perfect. Perfection not come without reaching to the real position. Mm. In the kosa is not perfect. Yes, Gurudev. I think also the the body is getting sicker, but the mind is not getting older. You know, the body is used to, you know, we cannot use the body like we used it before in old age, but the mind is still so young. These ideas never stop. It's, it's ever, you know, fresh, the mind, if it's also put on the material things. 
Therefore, this flower, is the, my practice. Flower, flower like a booming. Every morning, ten flower booming with ten ideas. Yeah. <laughs> and if you, Every if morning, not, fresh. <laughs> and what you want to make? Oh my God! Ten ideas are ten flowers and beautiful smell. Why not to pick it? And mind is working on with this. <laughs> <My> God. <laughs> Never ending story. What <laughs> but, but, but you see this in the point. <laughs> For me it's not your door and how to run away from this material world. That to do. Try to close, block yourself. Intense that we have to do. We know Dwava says we, we without doing is oh I'm very satisfied, very happy, nothing will work. Intense. <laughs> Intense by force, by hook and crook. Mm. Mm. I have to break one by one, Kosa, to enter in reality of divinity. Mm. Till the Kosa is covered, it will be jumping like this. <laughs> And one thing, in the class as the one thing, when he till is a black, again fresh. Mm. So Kosa, if you give the chance for healing back, mm -hmm. they will heal you inside, <laughs> in that layer. <sighs> you know? You, you have to very intense. Kusha's body has the energy to heal it himself. Mm. That is the very wide idea. Intense. We need intense. Mm. 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 Time is short, work is long. Honestly, this is the point. Sometimes body will become sick. Sometimes some some anadosh will come. Many things will come. Many things has to cross to go to that. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> this this inner conflict is because false ego want always again and again to propose himself like only owner and propriety. Hmm. Uh, yeah, I said so long for only for you. Your question answer I give. About the Kosa and everything I say, only for you, my dear. Your answer was that. Shirad. Thank you, Gurdiv. Divinity means I have to reach to that divinity. Mm. You know? Yoga say so many kosas. What it means layer of the body. Kosa means the layer of the body. The subtle layer, no more. Subtle gross body, subtle body, and like this. Nine, eight kosas are there. So means they are layer of the bodies are there. Mm. And the spiritual, my identity, 
consciousness situation position is sitting inside in my body also so many layers covered that <laughs> Mm. And in this covering, we forget my reality. We see outside. And if I want to go to divine, I have to reach to divine to go to divine. I cannot go with material to speak divine. Forget. Mm. Anamaya Kosha will bring you to Anamaya Kosha. He cannot bring you to Pranamaya Kosha. Huh? You will like to meet with Anamaya Kosha. <laughs> Yes, Gurudev, this Anamai coach is that is because I am, because I am eating. This is identifying. Yeah, I want this part. some eating man to be associated that I can enjoy my senses. So always we want to eat and enjoy this. Yes, that is the point. This is Anamai coach. Subtle body is also one coach. We make the whole um, new life. We marriage in the dream. We have uh, many children also. We become king in the dream. We have many cars in the dream. <laughs> we have a nice wife in the dream. <laughs> <laughs> all, all, all in the dream. New life, new. <laughs> <laughs> it is one kosha. <laughs> oh my God! But it just like subtle kosha. Mm. Okay. Morning time, all dream is gone. Hey, what happened? <laughs> my God! I have to sleep a little more. Come back to my dream. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I wake up. My God! <laughs> so all is all is the dream. Radhe, Radhe, Shri Radhe, Shri Radhe. Real by the. Yeah. What the Anand? When you enter and you realize and you see the ananda of that. Mm. If you have to do what outside searching, search within yourself and realize more and how you will search, you see the part in a mind and see the good thing in others. And your search will, research will come and realization will grow. Always check what is the minus thing inside. And what is the best person? Somebody said, no, 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 he's a bad person. He said, no, I see good thing in this. Research always say good. Never see bad to us. Shri Radha Guru Dev. Thank you so much. <laughs> Beautiful. Shri Radha. <clears throat> mm. So, yeah, I would like to. This feeling, na? feeling has to be positive. Live in the positive. Think positive, do the positive. Mm. Mm. Yeah, that's positive life. Is devotional life. Mm. Is a gentleman life. <laughs> gentleman. Life. Gentleman. 
Hmm. I don't believe that meat eater cannot be gentleman. I want Prabhupada's word gentleman. Hmm. Hmm. Gentleman life is more better than I am meat eater and I am not meat eater and I am a crazy man. Mm. Yeah. Gentleman has to respect. They are sensitive people. Mm. The circumstances they do, but he didn't. Hmm. So let's go back to Guru Dev's book. Spiritual life is feelings. You see, <laughs> honestly, if the moment you become feeling less, then you start looking negative. Mm. I don't know what Mm. This table has no feelings. But if you operate a computer, it will dance. A robot has no feelings, but it can work 24 hours. We are not robots. We have feelings. But living in the mind makes you mm. feeling less. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Mm. <laughs> I don't like this thing. I don't know if it <laughs> is understanding is not clear to me. This is some mercy. How Sunit, uh, I think that Suniti write it and put mine. <laughs> <laughs> so good, Dave. <laughs> That's all you owe. <laughs> <not good. laughs> but we had this already because why in the mind become feeling less? Because we are calculating. And that's why it is also so much stressful mm. to always live in calculation. I know this also from my experience. I can calculate very quickly and it's a big problem. <laughs> <laughs> because always you find out quickly what is in there for me, what is good and what is not so good. But when I come into Chitta Britti, when I try to concentrate on Swamini, then I only think what is best for my service to Swamini and what is not so good for my service to Swamini. Hmm. And then it becomes pure. Before it was only me and mine and uh you know, this calculation of the money and of the good and the bad and looking good. But mm. then it becomes for Swamini, for my service, for the Vaishnavas, for Gurudi, for Radha Mohan. Then it becomes clear, easy and not such a big headache. And feeling full, easy. Mm. 
Mm. Beautiful. Then Gurudev continues, no qualification. then it is a waste of time. We go in philosophy to cover myself, <laughs> to cover my goal of life. <laughs> this is the point. What is, I don't understand what is. Good, so, I think that um, the point is, you were speaking at that time, it was 2014, 2015, you were speaking to all of us, we were coming from different, different schools, you know, from the school of ISKCON or Narayan Maharaj, and we all, we try that philosophy is our uh, qualification. Mm. We were very much at that moment, we were trained that, that if I want to be a good devotee, I have to know all the scriptures. And uh, if I want to, you know, be a good preacher, because everyone at that time should be a preacher, I need to uh, say and repeat all the verses, first the Sanskrit and then the meaning. And so, because this was such a stress, especially for me, because I'm not so smart with the verses. And I had some in my heart. I feel this is not true. No, I feel my heart. Swamini is telling me it is not true. Divine love is not about knowledge. Mm. Not it must not be the goal that divine love we can get if I am very smart, I'm a scholar, I'm a pundit. So at that time, you were telling us this. If we always think we are going into this philosophy and trying to understand things, it is also a blockage. Hmm. Of course, when I am new in bhakti, and I need to understand some ABCs, you know, who am I? Why am I here? And who is my goal? What is the goal of my life? What is the soul? There must be some knowledge also that is ABC knowledge, but only to live in the knowledge, to think I have to prove myself by being, uh, you know, a pundit or a scholar or a Sanskrit expert. You were telling us and you were like, hammering us at that time Gurudev that this is not the goal so we can come into our feelings because also at that time you were telling us this story I think it's all I don't know if it's in the book when you go to traveling first you come to America South America and you also try to learn something from the books <laughs> and uh but then you speak only from your heart and it came like a flow it's not the book knowledge that makes us a devotee. Because in material life, we are used to being qualified by our, um, what do you say, doing. No, we are very much uh, trained to be the doer. And now you want to train us at that point, become the viewer. Mm. Believe in the grace of Swamini. Mm. Believe in your feelings to Swamini, in your goal. Get Ishtadev, get Swamini as your Ishtadev, and then let again, let her do it. And let the grace work in your life and let love work in your life. And that was the point at that time. And again and again, you're also helping us to remember that, to live in the flow of love, to serve love. And not think I must be so materially or, you know, spiritually qualified by uh, being a perfectionist or being a controller of my tongue, of my speaking, of my verses. At that time, it was very much our conviction. And because you were so merciful, Gurudev, you catch us out of this trap. It's a trap. You fall into a hole. 
No, you think I must be a spiritual person. I must know all verses. I must know all tattva. We were stuck in this tattva. And nowadays I realize that uh, by letting this go, letting this, you know, this idea of myself, I have to be like this, then I can be a spiritual person, then I can be a good devotee. It was a very important process, and you help us so much with this, Gurdi. Mm. And that is why we cannot feel Swamini, because we were only thinking about this mode or this controlling my verses that I know, controlling my senses, controlling my you know, everyday habit. We were much, much uh, stuck in some concept of spirituality that somehow didn't work out. And you were, I mean, I'm talking about myself now. You were liberating me from this, Gurdiv. Really, I feel liberated nowadays because I don't believe anymore that I have to be a big scholar, a big pundit. I just need to open myself for the grace and go step by step and come closer to Swamini with the holy name, with the kirtan, with the association of the sweet devotees, with the dasis who want to be a dasi, who want to live and feel Vrindavan. No, every day that, you know, sweet feeling of love, the sweet exchanges is a different kind of love than than what we know from this world. It's more sweet and more soft and very tender. And by your mercy, Gurudev, you were you are giving this to us. So that maybe uh, is in, important to know what you are talking at this moment. How this is a waste of time to cover myself in philosophy. Mm. Yes, Andakaji, you can also say something. You have also experience. <laughs> experience. Coverings of old concepts of bhakti mm. that can go away like a snake is also shifting, uh, you know, different skins or like the, the butterfly. It, it has been a worm before, but it needs to go through that process, eating, eating, eating. We were eating the books eating the verses and eating, you know, so many concepts. Mm. But to become a butterfly, we need to transform to a Darcy that is very simple and foolish like a child. Now this is mm. so so nice to be foolish. Now mm. finally I can say I'm very foolish and I'm happy with it. <laughs> Relaxed, fool. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Now what you said reminded me of uh, how Rupa Goswami said, it's okay to some extent, to for some time, to cultivate goodness. Goodness means transcendental knowledge, approaching God, having some uh, transcendental inform spiritual information <clears throat> but at some point you have to give this up also it's not the goal to stay in goodness happy with information and happy that i don't know yeah goodness is good place from material point of view the best place in material way in material life goodness but uh, yeah, it's a trap again. You don't you don't reach your your full potential. Full potential is on the other side. It's not here. And then you are stuck. You think that's it. You are stuck, but not happy. Yeah, mm. it takes mercy to go out of this trap. This is the mo the best trap, golden cage. <laughs> I know, I can, uh, I don't know what. 
I'm this, uh, this so many years. I have so many experience. I went to this and then I did this and then we go to, you know, it's so much reasons why to stay in gold cage. Yeah. Yeah, we need mercy. It's important. What uh, reminded me also, Krishna says, <laughs> Dai Vihiesha, Gunamai. It's divine trap. This trap is divine. It has this power <laughs> to keep you in. It's so attractive. It's golden. It's shining. Yeah, mercy, 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 mercy. I have no other... I don't, uh, in my experience, there is no other way out. What you, what you described. Gurudev wakes you up and liberates you. So that's it. <laughs> Someone who is liberated and awaken comes and says, wake up, wake up. <laughs> wake up, wake up. There is freedom from even this cage. You are not meant to be in cage. You have these wings. You poor bird. <laughs> you can fly. There is a world outside cage, amazing world of love. Yeah. I feel only mercy. The only way to progress is mercy. I mean, I mean, this is my experience. <laughs> this is my experience. <clears throat> yeah. So, Sniti Didi, uh, it's very touched about, so to become foolish is very best life. <laughs> I totally agree. I, I, I don't feel interest to become pandit, <laughs> but uh, why we can say like this? We can become foolish if we have mother. Without mother, we cannot become child. We can get an Istadeva relationship. If we, if there are no relationship, we have to think, oh, I have to do only myself. I become strong. I should conquer many difficulties. But like a ten, ten we really accept it. Mm. Our real relationship and there is mother. We are crying, mother, I need you. Then, Gilded a few days ago says, just close with him, close with her, sorry, close with her, <laughs> both, <laughs> both. <laughs> so anyway, close, then, this far, so then Swamini think, oh, I have to take care of this baby. So thank you very much, Nintu, it very, very touched my heart. So we can become foolish. We really remember our relationship with our Swami. Yes, foolish means to be uh, into in a deep relationship with full of trust and faith. And then I can let it go and let it flow. Mm -hmm. Because I feel that most conditioning comes by trying to prove something to God or to Goddess. But now I know I don't need to prove anything anymore because I know I cannot mm -hmm. be qualified. But mercy and grace and the connection, the following in our Guru Parampara, in our Guru Dev, in our dear brothers and sisters' love, it makes me more relaxed. Mm -hmm. And faith, it is the faith that comes by relationship. It's not I have to do it my way, no? Before it was the fight, the struggle for mm. something. I don't know what. It's a habit. <laughs> Not the fighting, the struggling for existence. This world is tough. I have to be good. I have to also be mm. tough. I have to show to the world that I could do it. I can survive. You know, like this belief of Darwin. 
survival of the fittest. <laughs> Now we come to the level of uh, becoming alive through the softest. <laughs> you know something? It's a complete difference. <laughs> mm. We become alive by becoming soft, tender, loving, feeling. Mm. That is our constitutional position. Mm. That is our being. It's me. It's not, I have to do it, I have to fight, I have to be strong, I have to prove it all male, no? mm. this material ego male. But mm. the female, the, the goddess, our Swamini's energies and ours is that the softness, the tenderness, making others happy for their own happiness, not for my happiness. These are so beautiful qualities. And now we can finally, finally... Mm. Uh, feel them and become mm. more close to them and become mm. more trusting that this is the way, this is mm. the mercy, and that is the way to 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 live and to feel. So I feel it's a very uh, soft path and sweet path. And even when we have the the time will come when we have to go out of the body, I feel now it's more easy to let go. It's not that I have to be afraid that I missed something or, you know, I did as much as I can do. And now I rely on the mercy. And now I surrender to my, my dear Swamini, to my Guru Devi, to all my brothers, Vaishnavas and sisters. And I let it go. Now it's time to go out of the body. And then I can be peaceful, you know. It's not that I have to be so stressed. I can be tenderly. In shelter. Mm. Thank you, Gurudev, <laughs> for giving you us this up. tender song. <laughs> <laughs> I got no say. Yeah, see. <laughs> Radha, Radha. You make us children, Gurudev. You make us big adults. Those big adults with the double-sized head, you make us soft and small again. Become soft and small. Big, bless me to be. Not only child, foolish also. Mm. Mm. Uh, so time is coming to maybe close this Zoom meeting. Gurudev, how do you feel? Very good. How is my Jananda Maharaj? Jananda Maharaj. I'm missing him. Yeah, tomorrow is big day for him. Uh, he is doing uh, 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 Antia Lila overview of Antia Lila whole my day. Yes, yeah, so my he needs God. energy, <laughs> energy and preparation. Well, Viraha. Hmm. Viraha Lila. Viraha Lila. Yes. He, he can go in Viraha. Yes. Anta Lila is the Gambhira, Gambhira Lila. Eh. And a very intense Lila. Hmm. My Gurudev said, this Leela. Mm. He said, never break that I leave you. He sent me out. When one time we are sitting, he said, never listen to any Leela when the, the subject comes that Krishna is living, go out from there. Ooh. Not listen that is through the area. 
Never. And they say the stupid like this. Mm. Mm. When one talk, I close it. <laughs> I not listen. Wow, Shri Radha. Thank you for sharing this, Gurudev. 